You might be wondering how to add motion blur to your footage when editing in Final Cut Pro. It's actually pretty easy if you have Apple Motion, but it's even easier if you don't have Apple Motion. Let me explain. If you have Apple Motion, you can create your own custom motion blur presets, which can then be imported into Final Cut Pro. You can create subtle motion blur, more obvious motion blur, or even extreme motion blur. All you need to do is create a Final Cut Pro title, delete the text and head over to the render drop down menu to turn motion blur on. With the project selected, you can head over to the inspector, go to properties and adjust the motion blur parameters down here. Samples will set the number of subframes rendered per frame, higher sample values will give you higher quality motion blur, but are more processor intensive and take longer to render. The shutter angle will adjust the size of the motion blur. Increasing the shutter angle increases the number of frames over which the shutter is open. Now, you can't publish these parameters to make the blur customizable in Final Cut Pro, but you can duplicate it and create as many presets as you want, and then you can save them in your titles folder, which can be found under movies in the motion templates folder. See, pretty easy, right? But what about that even easier method? Well, you can download my free Motion Blur plugin pack, linked down below, which comes with minimal, subtle, medium, strong, and extreme Motion Blur presets. They work as title presets, which means you can drop them on top of your footage like an adjustment layer, but they also come as effects presets, meaning you can add the motion blur to entire clips, which is cool for time lapses, or if you want to add motion blur to a specific layer only, like this logo. Motion blur is a pretty processor intensive effect. Don't forget to render those sections using the shortcut Control R if playback is slow. These are the motion blur presets I use in Final Cut Pro and I know that you're going to love them too. I also know that you'll love seeing them in action in this full behind the scenes video where I break down the planning, shooting, editing, color grading and sound design for the cinematic tattoo b-roll video.